Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's been a bit since we last spoke, but I trust you all are doing well. I uh, enjoyed all the craziness that went down this last weekend of the the Triple Crown winner of American Pharaoh. Had a great UFC card on Saturday night as well. Also, uh, good to see the Cavs come back and win that game too, so that was pretty exciting. Um, just went to get groceries on Monday at Walmart, and I've checked the, the Funko Pops. The Funko Pops are always up at the front of the store near the card, the card collectibles and the such. And I've checked it a dozen times for a Brock Lesnar and just have never found them until the, just this last time I finally found one in stock. And I'm pretty stoked because I've looked countless times, been to dozens of Walmarts, and never been able to find them. I, you know, I could easily snag one on eBay, but like finding them out in the, you know, the thrill of the chase and finding them in the wild is definitely the fun part of the Funko Pop collecting. Uh, but today I thought I'd throw a little something different onto the channel. Uh, I saw my YouTube stream just last month. There was this cool new product around called Comic Con Box. And, uh, you know, it's similar to like Loot Crate if you've seen anything like that. Where it's just uh, you know gifts monthly. This is made by Wizard World. You know the you know the go tos of all the comic conventions of across the country. And the first box that I saw was pretty loaded. It had you know toys. It had shirts. Um, there was like candy in there. And the thing that really drew me to it, they had like exclusive comics. But I was seeing that people were snagging 8x10 autographs. They have, you know, kind of like bonus boxes with additional gifts in them. So I'm not for sure if there's anything like that in this box. I just got it in the mail today, so I figured we'd open it up together and see what this Comic-Con box is all about. They just recently had a three-month subscription where you would get an exclusive variant cover of a new Secret Wars comic book coming out from Marvel. And I figured, well, you know, summertime, the comic conventions, that's when they're at their height. So it would be a cool little three-month promo to go ahead and give this a shot. So this is just the first month, so we'll have two more of these to come. So let's get into it and see exactly what's in here. Box is pretty nice. You can check out, you know, hit him up on Twitter, Comic Con Box, and uh, hashtag Con Life. To report some of all you're finding. Turn your camera on. Listen, I'm, I'm actually reading the box. Turn on the camera, unbox the box, upload and win epic prizes. Go to the website to let you know. So, who knows where this will be seen one day, but hopefully you guys will enjoy it as much as I am. It's like Christmas early. I got a nice sealed box here on the side. It's like Christmas in June over here. I've bought a couple of loot crates before, but I'd already known. It was mostly because I knew what like the exclusive figure was and the such. But this is like the first blind gift box subscription service that I've ever had. So kudos to Comic Con for getting me to uh, to fork out some dough. And it looks like just off the get, we got some interesting looking things in here. Uh, to start us off, we're gonna go with a. A mustache friends mustache you can wear mustaches you can wear choking hazard so yeah it's just a fake party mustache wow they got like 38 different styles and colors yeah pretty interesting mustache party I might have to drink you know rock this next time I'm drinking some Pacifico Pacifico and lime sitting outside around the grill and wear my fake mustache Pretty interesting, and I knew there was something super heavy in it, and boy, this thing is a monster. This is this is perfect for a guy like me, because I drink, this is a, like an extra large coffee mug. This is a monster, and I believe this is Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., if I'm correct, Strategic Homeland Intervention Enforcement, Logistics Divisions, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Marvel, extra massively big coffee mug and that's cool because I drink coffee like crazy so this isn't for uh, this isn't for the begin this isn't a beginner's coffee cup this is for you know those who like to drink so definitely that's pretty cool uh, next up it looks like well I'm about to drop the box here looks like we have a shirt 
And for the shirt, it looks like we have no strings attached. Comic Con box is probably like an exclusive t-shirt. We can get an idea. Looks like kind of like a modern take of Pinocchio. No strings attached with this guy giving birth to an evil robot. Uh, the concert tee made by District. So that's pretty cool. And whatever you do sign up for the box, they ask for the, uh, the your t-shirt size preference. So. So next up we have this little odd interesting piece and this is actually, you know, this is odd because I do need one of these and it's kind of cool. It's a luggage tag, leg of the movie luggage tag. I do travel often so yeah, you can basically just put in all your info right there. It's got all the areas for all your information. Just slap, slap that onto your suitcase and you're good to go. And how many people actually have a cool piece of Lego for a luggage tag? So that's, yeah, very unique. I dig that. So that's kind of cool. Next up we have Avengers Mashems. Twist and Squashing. So, yeah, this looks like something interesting. It might be fun to open on cam, so if we twist it, is it going to pop open? What is it? Some sort of mashup. So what, is it just something... Oh, is it like a stress ball? It's probably like a stress ball, is what I would imagine it is. In, in, in case you're just feeling the rage, you can just grab your Hulk and just squeeze his head. And there's something oddly satisfying about that. I used to have a, a, a great, I used to work at a call center where I was taking calls from customers all day and it would just drive you up the freaking wall. So the company actually would pass out stress balls and they were a little bit bigger than this, but uh, oddly satisfying when you're just filled with rage that uh, you can just sit there and squeeze it and, you know, actually make you feel a little bit better. So that's cool that uh, have a little bit of carrying case so that way you don't lose it or whatever. And this totally applies to me. If you've seen my YouTube videos before, I, I, uh, I'm mostly known for doing box breaks of different sports, trading card wise. But um, this looks like it's a pack of Cree Skull Wars cards. Nine. This is a hobby pack. Nine cards per pack. I don't know if they have chases for sketch cards included in these or not. But let's bust it and see what these cards look like. Some really nice looking art cards. Yeah, it looks like these are just art cards of some type. Power. That just must be some sort of chase set. Insert. But yeah, there's a, it gives you an idea what those cards are like. Move that out of the way. It looks like we have like a couple of coupons. Here we have, let's see, Metal Earth 3D Metal Model Kits, Master Chief Helmet, Museum Quality. Simply pop out the pieces from the steel sheet and connect using the tab. So, yeah, that'd be a cool project to do someday for some Halo fans. Just basically a metal, it looks like they're just metal sheets that you just put together. And your finished product is the Master Chief helmet from Halo. So that would be a fun, fun project to do if you're a fan. And it looks like, yeah, I think they gave these out in the last one, Con TV. This is a free two-week trial. Just a little promo for it. Home.contv.com slash conbox. And I think this is uh, this guy, whatever his name is, he's also an amateur MMA fighter. He's the Green Power Ranger. He has a series that's exclusive to this Con TV network that I saw on TV. Looks like Bruce Campbell's on there as well. She Ra, Godzilla. Godzilla movies. How cool is that? And at the very bottom, we have a big piece of paper, or a big bag. 
it looks like we got some comic books and an art print. So with this art print, it doesn't look like it's autographed or anything. Batman and Iron Man, which is a pretty cool mashup. I don't see an artist name on there. They probably have that information on their website somewhere. But yeah, that's a pretty cool mashup drawing. Art print, it's like an 8x10 printed on nice, you know, thin cardboard stock, gloss on the front. Batman versus Iron Man mashup. And this is the. This here is the Comic Con exclusive variant edition of Secret Wars. This is an homage. I read online that this is an homage to uh, Incredible Hulk 181, where Wolverine and the, the Hulk are doing battle on the cover. So this is the variant edition, and this other comic book that was included with it, this is the, what you get when you sign up for the three-month subscription. So this is just another variant edition, which I would oppose. I guess it's more rare, so you got the two of those. So I saw, like, um, and that looks like it's pretty much it. There's one more coupon in the box. Next month's adventure box has been yeah so that's box three that's the theme for box number three will be adventure so that's pretty cool just a okay so yeah and then here on the back it gives you just an info of exactly what's all included in the box so it's kind of like a recap and see here it is Rob Pryor he's the guy who did that art print. So no strings to catch. Yeah, so that's cool. So yeah, it's you know, kind of like a recap of what's in your box. I didn't see um on if you follow them on Instagram, Comic Con box on Instagram, they also post up there like what the months like they have like six or seven chase prizes every month, and they usually I think there was like four or five eight by tens and. You know, just gathering from what I see here, I don't think any of the extras, I don't think I got any of those with that. But the biggest score of the box was getting this uh, this cover right here that's exclusive to those who just got the three-month subs subscription. So, yeah, pretty cool box all in all. You know, this is the first time I've ever done it. So, it's like, yeah, there's definitely cool, some cool stuff in here. You know, oddly enough, I, I really dig the luggage tag and the coffee mug. I'm definitely going to get use out of both of those. And, uh, yeah, the comic books, you know, I do plan on going to the Tulsa Comic Con in October. So maybe there will be some of the artists, you know, that's uh, connected to this book. And maybe I'll be able to get it signed on my own as well. Or even get that Batman or Iron Man print signed. That would be pretty awesome. But yeah, um, I'll definitely go ahead and put all the info in the description so you can take a look at the, the site itself, comiccombox.com. Um, but yeah, they should definitely have, they'll probably have some more promotions, you know, coming up with, you know, like the three-month promotion that got me to sign up. So if it does seem like something that you'd be interested in, definitely check out the other videos on YouTube because they had some sweet bonus gifts. They had like, uh, there was Norman Reedus, the, you know, Daryl from The Walking Dead. He had signed 8x10s that were inserted into some of the boxes. That would have been sweet to score. Um, they're going to have signed Funko Pops and action figures. And last month's box, I saw that there, they had sketch drawings, like the blank cover comic books. There was people that was getting sketches on their comic books. So that's pretty awesome too. So there's definitely a lot of value there. So definitely check out ComicComBox.com. And definitely check out my videos. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Until next time, enjoy your day, and thanks for watching. Peace.